Hello students, today you are going to create your own blog. First, you have to click here on the right side, this is called Google App Waffles. Click here and next on Blogger. So you will see some things that you can use to have your blog, a wonderful blog. If you click here on create your blog, it will take you to write your password again. So now you can access into Blogger. Remember, go to Google App Waffles, scroll the mouse and go click on Blogger. Now you are able to start. Click on create your blog. Okay, here you have to write a title that is going to appear in the upper side of your blog. So in this case, I'm going to write my favorite things to do. Okay, once you have written the title, go to next. And here you're going to write a web address that all the users can find your blog online so I, I will write the same you can write the, the the address that you like my favorite thing to do as you can see is available because if you write a no a common name maybe it won't be available so you have to look for one that is not so common and next so here uh, another title for your blog so I will write the same remember in the previous address the web address is it ends with blogspot.com here is the title so and click on finish Now you can start creating your blog. Uh, here in this side, there are some entries. As you can see, you click on entry. Uh, you can write a title. It's like a Microsoft Word page because you can write text. You can add image. Let's look for an image that says welcome. Welcome is a gift. Okay, let's click on one of them. Remember, GIF has movement, so it's more attractive for the users. So you click with the right side of the mouse, you can copy, save the image on your laptop. Also, you can share the image just copying the URL and you can place that on your blog. So here, Click on image from the computer, photos, blogger, or URL. In this case, I will look for the image in my computer. Select files, and it will take you to your uh, files in the computer. Let me look for the file or the picture. Here it is. Okay, once, once it's here, you have to click on the image and then select. And you will have this. You can enlarge the picture. And you can publish immediately. So it will appear immediately. Or you can see a preview. Look. You have a title and the first entry. That is the welcome words. And people can write comments on your blog. Mm -hmm. This is the way people see it on their cell phones. Look. And also the tablet and on the computer. So you have your first entry. You can also add P 
okay yes let let me add another entry remember to save you have to save i will show you later how to save uh let's select a team there are many things that we can use to give to personalize your blog look there are many different things you can select with different colors different backgrounds how you can put the text how does the text appear you can do it manually too how do you want to uh, they accommodate every part of your blog let's select one of this as you can see there are many very attractive and remember the blog is a way to express yourself and publish things news and anything that you want to share with people and this is very very interesting not only for your activities in, during your school years but also for your professional life you can use a blog to make comments about some things that happen in the world on your country i will select this one uh, you have to click on apply oh, you can see a preview you can personalize so you have different options yeah so you click here i understand and then you can see how it is now your blog with a new background um, let me click here let me create another entry and then later we will see how is your blog okay let's publish a video let's write a title here uh, you can write text remember you can put the size of the text bigger smaller in bold change the color underline in italic so you have all the options that you will see in a page from Microsoft Word. It's the same. And I have this, the purpose of my blog. This is a useful blog. It's a great example of how to build. Da, da, da. So let me look for a video from YouTube. It's the same. You have to click on the right side of your mouse. Click the copy, the URL, and then you go to your blog. And you have the option to add like a link so the people that want to see what is that about they have to click on the link change here the the name of the text that will appear video how to avoid COVID-19 click here and you click on apply so when people click here they will see the video or you can to upload or paste from internet in this case youtube and you paste the url here url search and you will find that the video that you created and you click on select and you will have the video on your entry and you can enlarge the same like the image you can do the same now you have two entries okay they are draft right now so you you haven't published when you are ready when you think that is it is ready you can publish okay i publish in the other side i will publish this too so now people can see your first and second entries let's see let me scroll down and you click here on see your blog uh, as you can see the one the theme that we selected you can see the title the first entry and then the second will become the first so once you are publishing the entries uh, kept down and the newest they keep in the first position we can add pages to your blog 
the pages are more static. You don't, they are not, they don't change. You have, okay, let's create a page and I will show you how does it function. You can write a title, the same. You can have many pages, as the, the amount of pages that you want. And also, uh, the amount, the, the, as much entries as you want to. So here, trip to the countryside, and you can place pictures there, upload pictures, videos about your experience in the countryside. Uh, let me create another, my trips is better instead of the trip to the countryside. Here you can add text, images, and you can publish. Excellent. So you can put everything that you want about your trips. Let's create another. For example, my favorite food. So you can publish about what kind of food do you like. You are like Japanese food, Chinese or Italian. You can upload pictures or videos, your own recipes. And let's create another page. Um, my, for example, languages that I like or that I know. So you can search about the culture of other countries and everything that you know about the language, videos of you talking with friends in another language, practicing your English, etc. Okay? So, in this case, I changed the title, all related to my favorite country. So, you can write about the culture of another country. This, these are some examples. Remember, publish. And if you click here on see your blog, you won't see the, the pages that you have created, only the entries. So, you have to do something to activate the pages let me show you so you have to go back to your blog close here and go to blogger <coughs> so you have to go down and click here on design click on design and then here you have many tools like an editor click here on add gadgets you have like 26 gadgets that you can use to improve your blog but we are going to click here on pages okay uh -huh. you have the option to write a title for your pages let's write important things or important facts important things to do the same so you have here you have to select all the pages that you want to appear on that site okay on the main page and you save now it's ready now you can see you can see all the pages will appear on your blog let's click here on as you can see, they are on the top of your blog. All related to my favorite country, my favorite food, my trips. So you have different sections in your blog that you can add more information. And people can write comments. Uh, your teacher can evaluate what you have done and write some advice or whatever. So this is the way you can have your own blog and uh, be creative, innovate, improve yourself, not for now, for your future, because this is used for professional life too. So guys, see you next time. If you like it, share. Bye.